Hello and welcome to my channel. Hope you're all feeling strong and well. Nice little vlog for you today. We're just going to go for a bit of a walk and a talk about the GoPro Hero 9. That's what we're recording on right now. About the internal audio on the GoPro Hero 9. Is it acceptable? Now, as I was driving into the car park here at uh, Scamenden, you can just see Scamenden Dam over there. We're going to walk around Scamenden Dam. Just come up to this reservoir here. This is one of the Wesenden reservoirs but we're going to walk down there down to Scammon and Dam. As I was coming in in the car uh, I saw a beautiful uh, buzzard, really big one, down in these uh, trees down here and using the GoPro lens uh, we're going to get a really close-up image for you of that buzzard. That's not going to happen is it? No because I've only brought the GoPro with me, I don't have a long lens so you'll have to take my word for it. Now it does look like it's going to rain and that kind of plays into what I'm talking about today. I'm waterproof. If it starts raining, I've got a waterproof jacket. My boots are waterproof. Everything is waterproof. I'm going to be okay. But is my camera waterproof? Well, I of course know what you're thinking. It's a gift. <laughs> I use the GoPro Hero 9, as you know, and that is a 100% waterproof camera but not when you are using the media mod. So today I am out testing the internal microphones of the GoPro Hero 9. And it's uh, very much like the GoPro Hero 10 as well. These two cameras are almost identical. The only real difference between the 10 and the 9 is the chip, is the internal chip. The internal chip of the 10 is of course uh, twice, maybe three times as fast. But the video quality and the audio performance is uh, almost identical. So yes, we are testing the uh, internal microphones of the GoPro Hero 9. And uh, I thought it would be uh, pretty good for you guys to, to listen to it. When, you, when you're listening to someone that you're used to listening to, you usually hear me using the wireless Go. I use the wireless Go most of the time, so I thought it'd be uh, handy for you. If you're thinking about using your GoPro, or you've just bought a GoPro uh, Hero 10 or 9, and you're wondering how good the internal microphones are we're going to find out today because i'm going to need a waterproof 100 percent waterproof solution for my next long distance hike that i've got planned for 2022 and i hope you're going to stick with me as you did with the west highland way on my build up to that and we're going to be trying to get the uh, pack weight really down because i actually do want to wild camp it i can't believe i'm actually saying that but i do want to wild camp this and uh, i'm going to take everything i learned and the main thing that I took away from it is I need to get that pack weight down. So I hope you're going to help me out with that. It has just started to rain. So uh, <laughs> let's get on with this. So let me just tell you that uh, all the audio so far and till the end of this vlog is with the internal microphones on the GoPro Hero 9. Now we've got some ambient noise here, a bit of wind. Uh, so I'm interested to know how my uh, little uh, wind muffs are doing on the GoPro Hero 9. I've set them up. I'll give you a little picture of what I did. I have got the wind slayer for it, but I wanted to test these little wind muffs uh, to see if I could uh, get away with that. And uh, I thought I'd stand here because there's a kestrel hovering above just on the horizon there, which I'm sure you can see on the GoPro Hero lens. Beautiful, isn't it? And I must stress the Hero 9 and 10 because the versions before, um, the internal audio is absolutely hopeless. So this is only for the GoPro Hero 9 and 10. As I said before, the audio on these two cameras is almost identical. It's a cold one today. The rain is holding off. And what's the audio like? A bit of gate noise. Uh, what's the audio like? Put your comments in the comments section below. Let me know what you think. So we've got plenty of wind and tree noise. Uh, I'm not trying to say that this audio is going to be anywhere near as good as an external microphone. And when we're talking about the uh, GoPro 9 and 10 now, um, we've got to really think about what do we expect. A completely waterproof microphone, you're going to lose a little bit of audio quality. And uh, I think we can sacrifice that for being able to walk around in the soaking rain and uh, to be able to just stick this thing underwater. It records in such high resolutions. I think it's 5.7K, the Hero 10. And, uh, and the Hero 9 isn't far behind. We've got uh, a lightweight, ruggedized body. And you've also got the options if you want to uh, 
add to this already brilliant camera, you can get the media mod and you get two cold shoes to put lighting on and uh, external microphones. And uh, as we are recording today, we are actually on the max lens mod. So I've got unbreakable horizon leveling. So you can add that to it as well. Oh, and I forgot to mention the amazing slow motion built into this camera and the uh, hyperlapse and time-lapse also built in. And with the recent firmware updates to both cameras, uh, most of them for the Hero 10, of course. Uh, with the recent updates to these two cameras, most of the issues, the long, tough journey with the GoPro seems to be coming to an end. We seem to have a couple of good cameras here. So I am planning another long distance hike in 2022 and uh, taking what I've learned from the West Highland Way, I need to get that pack weight down and that's what this is all about. So future vlogs, I'm going to be uh, really uh, shaving off some weight from that backpack because I'm wanting to wild camp it. Can't believe I'm saying that, but I'm wanting to do it. I'll let you know details about that uh, long distance hike as we get into 2022. So this is the beginning of knocking the weight down. If I can just use this as a standalone camera, benefiting from the 100% waterproofness and uh, getting rid of the external microphones and the media mod, you're used to hearing my voice and a thank you for listening to me. <laughs> So you're used to hearing my voice uh, through the wireless Go and other external microphones on the GoPro Hero 9. What has the audio been like in this vlog? Is it acceptable? So thank you for joining me on this vlog, or of course I would be all by myself. That's it for this one. Where will I be next time? Well, I don't know, but I know I want you guys with me. So until the next one, bye. <laughs>